Hey YouTube, coming at you from the driveway here. I've got the tree farmer here. And I'm gonna go back down uh, behind the building here on the slope, test out these chains. Um, I got these put on this past weekend and I think it's gonna go, but there's only one way to find out and let's go try it. All right, so I scouted this out on the four-wheeler. Uh, looking up here behind me, we've got the garage building and then uh, where my firewood setup is. Uh, let me kind of pan around here. Should be able to tell a little bit of how steep this all is. And we get to this tree right here. Uh, that's kind of right in the middle of my road. Down here you can see how I kind of have to zigzag around that. I'm gonna push that out. So it'll help me uh, back up there. I don't like stumps, because then I hit them on the tractor and that's kind of not good. So uh, where I'm going, is down here at the bottom. I don't know how well this angle shows up on camera, but this is a pretty decent slope. This is the start. And then if I go and pan around over here, that is steep. So I don't think that I'm going to actually uh, go down in the bottom down there. I think what I'll do is somewhere in this area here uh, and just run the winch line down and drag stuff up. When I get to that, that's a ways off. This is doing mitigation, not logging. I'm by no stretch of the imagination a logger, uh, which I'm sure you'll see here in a minute. But uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come down the hill and I'm gonna try and push this out with a log arch. That way I don't get down here nose first. Uh, backing up and turning, this is sloped on both sides going down. There's nowhere I can do a three point or five point turn up here. So I would have to go down over one of those slopes. And the problem is when I back up trying to turn. So I'm gonna just back down and push this over. Check it out. There we go. One. And two. All right, if I'm being honest, I wasn't really planning on pushing both of those out, but as I'm kind of walking back down here, I just kind of realized that this one's going to be in the way as well. I want to go through here. So see if I can get the winch to go. So if you're wondering up here where I backed up against this tree, uh, I did that on purpose. I'm not trying to push the tree out, but this is a pretty good grade here. And I wanted to make sure I had something there as kind of a secondary parking brake. And if you're wondering about the gasping, I'm at 7,500 feet here. So the air is a little bit thin. I should have gloves on. <laughs> Whew. All right, so these two are choked and ready to go. Let's see how they pull.
so that worked pretty well actually um looks good see that that stump is without a doubt enough to roll my tractor down that hill so i don't think it'll flip the log skidder but that would absolutely be enough to flip my tractor over So we got that one. So looking up here, I'm gonna grab the uh, other one that I pushed down over there. So this is actually gonna turn into a decent path. 